Hey, boy. What is happening here? You looked after me last night with a little bar hopping trip around Melbourne. So, I'm going to do breakfast for you. Why do I get the feeling this is not breakfast for me and this is breakfast for you, though? I was about to say the exact same thing. This do. doesn't look like anything. This is not your kind of breakfast. Order. Is it? You, this is you all over. <laughs> There's lots of antioxidants in there. What do we got? It's going to do blueberry pancakes with just a little fruit salad. I'm not going to hate it, let's admit. No, no, you'll be right. Yeah. So, flour. But I think this is going to be like your foolproof recipe. Yeah. There are a few little pointers with pancakes which we'll go through. Is that like a no measure? Just throw some flour in. You don't measure anything with a pancake. Really? Self raising? Oh, yeah. Self raising flour, a little bit of baking powder as well, because you want that sort of double bounce. Yeah. So double bounce. Let it sit for a while and it starts to ferment a little bit. Basically, putting air to make a lighter pancake. Spot on. Knew I, I always knew I was some sort of scientist. Self raising flour, a little bit of baking powder, some sugar, just freestyle. And just taste your batter when yep. you get to the end. And if you need to add some more vanilla, some more sugar, yeah. it's completely up to you. So, what did you think of last night? Yeah, of course I loved it. It was like that bar scene in Melbourne is a scene like no other city in Australia. So, that's our, our batter made. No whisk. See how I haven't. You haven't overworked it. And you can see some bubbles starting to form already. Yeah. And you want to really gently work it so it can rise and rise and rise. Yeah, this whole thing of whipping all the lumps out, the less you work it, yeah. the more that they just go boop. Yeah. I don't want to sit that and let it ferment for 15 minutes or so. So these strawberries look unreal. They don't look real. They don't, do they? They look perfect. Actually, you can roughly chop them. I knew this was coming. I'll um, start picking some other things to go in. So some blueberries. Just go onto the markets and grab fruit that look good. Yeah. So cranberries, yeah. some goji berries. I was going to say, what kind of berry is this thing? You want one? <laughs> oh my god, you'd snap on that. <laughs> want a little squeeze of lime. Mm -hmm. You put some raw sugar in, my friend. And then some mint. That smells ridiculous. As soon as you hit those with that lime juice, the flavours really start to pop. Drizzle the vanilla in there. Oh, you just know that's going to taste good because it smells good. You could just get almonds, but it's me, so I've got almonds covered in sugar. Hate sugar. Yeah, so this very much was a breakfast for me. Oh, no, I mean, mate, I knew it. As soon as I walked out, this had nothing to do with me. I could have had the biggest hangover in the world. I still would have been eating fruit salad with heaps of sugar on it. Cream cheese I actually did get for you because it's a little bit more savoury than the mascarpone. I'll go the mascarpone. <laughs> <laughs> we can't win, can he? <laughs> Chop that up. I just want to melt it. We'll put it in the pot. Do you want to stir that butter in for me? So, mate, you would have heard the saying, the first pancake is always a flop. Yep. A real test of a good batter is it shouldn't be. Really? You've done these. What are we looking for? Bubbles. That's exactly what we're looking for. <laughs> when are you going to swing those blueberries in there? Once I reckon it's set enough on the bottom so that they don't sink and break through and cause us some, some damage. Are you a spatula flipper or are you a... I'm going to have a crack at the old... Do you want to go the first one then? Oh. Toss that over. I reckon you can do this. I've got no chance. Nailed it. Yes. You're not wrong. Yeah, no, no, and no breakthrough at the bottom. Yeah. So the blueberries aren't bursting through and, and creating a mess. You know what you're talking about. Pancake number one. And then it's just um, rinse and repeat. How, much, how many spoons did you get? One and a half I've been going. The nerves are still there with each flip. Oh, yeah! Oh. She's ready. Take him out. I must say, I'm actually looking forward to this. Really? I don't think I'll eat a third of what you eat, but I'm going to enjoy it. All right. I'm going to go hard with this. Now I'm just going to grab the last of these handed farm ones. Thank you. And you want to maybe pick some, some mint crumbs? Hook the words right out of my mind. And that's it. Boom. Mate, blueberry pancakes, fruit and mascarpone. Let's dig in. Oh, the fruit's epic. Yeah, the fruit's really good, to tell you the truth. Now, you'll notice I haven't fed you coffee. The reason I've held off is because we're going to go and see the sensory lab. The which gurus. is St. Ali's setup. Yep. You can't go to a better place, you reckon? Nah, I'm that keen. I'm going to have about 10. I'm going to be wired. Which is good, because we've got to drive ahead of us, too. Perfect. <laughs>